Less than 24 hours after President Muhammadu Buhari's spokesperson, Garbashu took to his personal verified Twitter and Facebook accounts to rebroadcast with a caption seemingly promoting a call for the people of Igbo tribe of the southeastern Nigeria to leave the country. Crisis broke out at Day Day International Market in Abuja and over five persons have been confirmed by the residents killed in the violent clash between the Hausa Okada riders and Igbo timber traders at the area. Garbashu had on Tuesday night reposted a video where Hakeem Baba Ahmed, the director of media and strategy, Northern Elders Forum told people of the South East to leave the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Garbashu accompanied the video with a message creating room for people to believe he's supporting or promoting the Northern Elders Forum call. The message reads, attached here is the videotape in which Dr. Hakeem Baba Ahmed, Director Media and Strategy, Northern Elders Forum telling the South East to leave the Federal Republic of Nigeria peacefully because they don't want another war. Garbashu's statement generated reactions on his Facebook and Twitter comment sections yet he has refused to alter the statement or make further clarification to what he meant by his words or the reason behind reposting of the Hakeem video. Though, NTA on Wednesday morning during its news broadcast, attributed words to Garbashu, claiming, the presidential aide condemned the Northern Elders Forum call for Igbos to leave Nigeria. Garbashu Facebook and Twitter accounts were revisited, it was discovered nothing of such statement as claimed by NTA was published or posted by Garbashu. As at the time of filling in this report on Thursday morning, Garbashu has not deleted the post or make any statement condemning the action of the Northern Elders Forum. At about 11.30 a.m. which is less than 24 hours Garbashu made the post on Tuesday, and Hausa Okada rider rammed into a trailer with his female passenger said to be an Igbo woman at Day Day International Market area in Abuja on Wednesday morning. The trailer as it was gathered crushed the woman to death. The Day Day International Market is said to be mainly dominated by traders of Igbo tribe. Angered by alleged recklessness of the Okada rider, the Igbo youths in the market ran after the Okada man and set the bike or motorcycle ablaze. Soon information reached other Hausa Okada riders in the area. They all mobilized and started attacking the traders and other road users indiscriminately in the area leading to the death of five persons at the spot. Some eyewitnesses said one of the persons killed was a pregnant woman. Greater than attached here is the videotape in which Dr. Hakeem Baba Ahmed, Director Media and Strategy, Northern Elders Forum telling the South East to leave the Federal Republic of Nigeria peacefully because they don't want another war. Pick.twitter.com slash MJ. RRFGBBDN. Greater than. Greater than Garbashu, at Garshu, May 17, 2022. Greater than you can help include referendum in the constitutional amendments so that it would be easier. Greater than. Greater than you should be providing solution and not this type of tweet, remember you are a leader. You are not at war with the eight bows. Greater than. Greater than Canaan, at new underscore kings, May 17, 2022. Greater than I didn't see anything wrong in what he said. If Igbo said they don't want Nigeria, let them pay Nigeria something and go. It's just like a marriage when your wife said she doesn't want the marriage anymore, must you force her to stay with you, let her just pay back your dowry and go. Greater than. Greater than engineer Yahaya Adora, at Yahya Durang, May 18, 2022. Properties and goods worth billions of naira were seen in the viral video set ablaze by the angry Hausa Okada riders. Most of the properties burnt were largely or entirely owned by Igbo traders as stated by the residents. Almost the entire timber section of the market was set on fire. Residents said the Hausa persons operated for hours before security operatives came to their rescue when Igbo youths had mobilized to retaliate the attack. Greater than movie camera, update. Scene of what happened earlier today at Day Day in Abuja. Hashtag creativity, writing, sparkles, https colon slash slash t dot co slash com slash one lhq. Orismal. Greater than. Greater than Mr. Creativity, at Moya Victor, May 18, 2022. Greater than whenever innocent Igbos are attacked, it's called clash. Greater than. Greater than Nigeria is not an option for the Igbo. HTTPS colon slash slash t dot co slash selutes 3 q 3 n Greater than. Greater than an uncle named Chike, at Unclechike 1, May 18, 2022. 
Greater than eyewitnesses have said several people are confirmed dead and many others injured as armed House of Fulani thugs, Okada riders, attacked Igbo businesses and properties at Day Day International Market, Abuja. Sokoto, Kano, and now this. Igbos in the north should arm slash protect themselves. Pick.twitter.com slash w 3 boj 9 Greater than. Greater than Somto Okonkwo, at General underscore Somto, May 18, 2022. Ongoing clash between Igbo traders and Hausa Okada riders in a very big market located in the federal capital city of Nigeria, Abuja. As of now, I'm not sure how many people have been killed, an eyewitness said. Also at press time, Garbashu has not issued any statement condemning the crisis that erupted at the Day Day International Market either on a personal ground or most importantly as a presidential spokesperson.